So, um, we had to sneak around because my mom's old boyfriend at the time, his shop was right there, and this nigga house was right here. I love Danji. Danji, welcome back to another video and thank you guys so 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 much for 11,000 subscribers I just want to say I don't know what I do without you guys honestly 11,000 subscribers in like what a couple of weeks is insane so I just want to say thank you guys so so much and hopefully you know we could get to like 20,000 by like the end of this month just saying just saying hopefully hopefully for today's video, I got this, you know, like, nice little story time. We're going to talk about how I lost my virginity for the fiends. For the fiends, though. Not my supporters, because it's been some of the people that have been fiending for me to talk about how I lost my virginity. I don't know why, but I guess we're just going to get that out of the way today. But before we talk about my story time, I'm going to need you guys to follow my Instagram, my TikTok, and my Snapchat. Because if you don't think I post enough on YouTube, I definitely do post on Instagram um tiktok snapchat you name it so make sure you guys go watch and interact with my content there <laughs> all right so starting off with the story time i think i lost it when i was 16 about to turn 17 so yeah that i was messing with this boy he was light skinned guys he was light skinned and let me tell y'all something i have a bad past with light skins you know i like to switch my flavors after i did you know, a few light skins that I talked to and I didn't like them. I didn't mess with my brush because my door skins, you know, my little my little chocolate poppies. <laughs> yeah, boy. <Isn't> lovely. <laughs> you know, because I just feel like light skins, y'all just do me so wrong. Y'all do me so wrong. Like, light skins just do me so wrong. Like, I just can't be with a light skin. I'm sorry. Like, oh, child. So, yeah, I think I was like 16, 17, and I'm not going to lie. Looking back, I probably wouldn't have lost it to him. I'm not even going to lie. Like, ladies, if you're watching this, like, please, please be very smart with who you lose it to. Because I'm not going to lie, this nigga's a fucking buffoon. I look back and I'm like, ew. <laughs> Ciao, ew. But then again, I'm, I dated him, so I'm not even going to judge. But, girls, just be very careful who you share your body with. But, yeah, so... Um, I think I was going in like into 10, no, that was 10th grade at the end of 10th grade. Yeah, it was like towards the end of my 10th grade year. He was very toxic. And I know what you're thinking, Danji, why would you, you, why would you lose your virginity to your first toxic relationship? Well, let me tell you, I don't know. I thought I liked him. I thought I was in love with him. I thought I was so in love with him, but I was not. I was not in love with that nigga. Bro, it was puppy love. I swear to God, when you're young and you get a boyfriend, oh my God, you get so infatuated. But um, deep down in my body, I knew I was not staying with that nigga. So anyways, y'all. So, you know, my little bookie, whatever, he he did his little his little thing after school. And we would just meet up when he's done with what he got to do and what I, got, what I would. And what I would do. Sorry, y'all. I'm stuttering. I don't know why. Um. So, yeah, we will meet up after school, and we will have to meet up sneakily because let me tell you, Ma, if you're watching this, I just want to say I'm sorry that you had to find out like this because I'm not going to lie. I lied to you, and I was going to take it to the grave, but you know what? I can't even take it to the grave no more because my supporters want me to exploit my life. So, um, we had to sneak around because my mom's old boyfriend at the time, his shop was right there and this nigga house was right here. So every time the bus would drop us off, I would have to look. Anyways, guys, I was just moving very sneaky whenever I would try to see him because you never know. You never know. You never know. And then you just get recognized in, in public. And now you, one, you get caught with a boy and two, you, you, you in a place where you're not even supposed to be. So whatever. I'm a dookie booty. We go to his room and guess what? He got the free. Oh my God, the nigga had the free, y'all. Just for that day, he had the free. Let me tell you how we how we met real quick. We met through friends, but the thing is, he always had a crush on me first. So he's always been interested in me first. So, so that day, since he had the free, he thought, oh, this is my time to shine. Guess what? It was that nigga time to shine. So you know what? 
nigga, I pat you on the back because guess what? You did it. But, 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 let me tell you how it felt. It was all right. Compared to now, that shit was trash. I'm not even going to lie to you. But it was my first time. Like, obviously, I gained experience through time, but that right there, my, my boy thought he knew what he was doing with that thing, but that thing was not thinging, okay? That thing was not fucking thinging. It's like when you really think about shit, you laugh. But in that moment, I was so hurt. I came home like, what did I do? What have I done? Because let me tell you something. In a Hispanic household, in a black household, in a Caribbean household, for, for, I don't even know, for fuck's sake, just know the girl is changing her mind that once you lose your virginity, you're not pure anymore. You're not a flower. So in my mind, I was going through it. I was like, what the fuck did I just do? And to be honest, like, once I did that, all that, <gasps> I don't like him no more. It just came out of nowhere. Once I did that, I did not like him. And then I was like, you know what? You know what? This is not the man for me. This is not the man for me. And let me tell you guys, he was not. I just loved him. And honestly, like, the biggest lesson I learned was not to trust light-skinned men. Nah, let me stop. Let me stop. Let me stop before all the light-skins attack me in the comments. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. In that moment, I learned to, like, be very careful with my body, feel me? Think twice. But honestly, it was a learning experience. I was 16, and, like, you know, I know better now. I'm 18 years old. Like, you know, I move like a lady, and I do what, I do what got to get done feel me and i and i very much take care of myself and i believe a lot of girls should take care of themselves too if you guys want tips let me know and i got you like i said i can make these into videos y'all just gotta let me know what content y'all want to see so yeah um there's not really much to the story rather than the fact that like um that was years ago and i would never get with that boy again because in my mind that boy is still a little a little boy i don't know what he looks like now i have not heard of that guy and and i don't even know how long like let me tell y'all something with me when i leave a guy i'm not gonna look back and check on the trash i'm leaving you in the trash for a reason and nine times out of ten when you see me in a relationship and it ended is because i ended it <laughs> Yeah, um, this is one of the many story times that I have. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I be trying to tell y'all, like, my life is very, 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 very exciting, very unexpected, very uneventful. I've had shitty relationships, crazy friendships, and I've done crazy shit in my life. Like, guys, if you guys, if you guys want me to put in a video, just let me know. Like, just let me know. Like, I really would literally sit in front of this camera and talk to you guys every day if you guys want me to. But yeah, um... Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and share. Like, you guys don't understand. Like, one share means the world. Two, two comments means the world. Three comments. Shit. Spam the comments for me if you want. Like, it, like you know, something goes a long way. Something that lets me know that you watch this video today goes a long way. But, um, yeah, follow me at all my Instagrams and everything. Let me know more video, video ideas. Like, guys, you ask, like, I shout, like, you know give like you ask you shall receive like i'm really here to like make content for y'all y'all just gotta vibe with me and stick with me and just really see me for me feel me so yeah like i said thank you guys again for 11,000 sus subscribers i love you guys so so much like i wish i could just hug you guys through the screen like ah! like all right <laughs> um yeah i love you guys so so much and bye